Hello and welcome to Mangly Town and today I have another video on the app game I play Train Station 2 uh, what's happening today is I'm moving up to a different country region on the game so I'm moving from Canada up to Russia and that means I need to get more trains now for the new country Russia I have 12,500 keys saved up ready um, you can use 100 keys or 200 keys to buy a train crate and you get a random train in it for that country so I'm planning on getting about a hundred new trains a lot of them will be duplicates uh, some of which I'll need um, but what we'll do is we'll go into the game and I'll start opening them up and we'll see what sort of mix I get so here we are in the game um, it happens that we're actually in the middle of an event at the moment which isn't going to be too helpful because my trains won't be that good for a while to carry on in the event uh, one thing I haven't done yet is I haven't claimed any of the rewards um, for the current event because uh, they'll go up as soon as I enter Russia and I've also got quite a few more train crates saved up there and also um, event keys so I can get more trains on the event in Russia as well so I've got 12,000 keys there and I've got easily about another 500 um, in those event rewards so that will give me the amount of keys that I want um, I'm gonna go for 50 of the 100 key crates 25 of the 200 key, key crates and then that will leave me enough that I can go back and get 25 more of the 100 key crates so that will be 100 trains in total plus the few extra from the event prizes and we'll see what sort of mix that gives um, in case you don't play the game there's various levels of trains you've got legendary which is the gold colored ones um, epic the purple ones rare the blue ones and the grey ones are the common trains you also get different fuel types so you've got steam, diesel and electric uh, it's good to have a good mix of these uh, in the legendary I really want three of the steam three of the diesel and three of the electric in the purple epics I want four of each fuel type the blue rares I want five of each and the commons a good five of each as well um, you don't get that many different trains um, for example in Russia there's only one uh, gold electric train so I'll be wanting three of that same train eventually or if I get an event um, gold electric then I only want two of the actual country ones and the event ones are obviously better because they give you more capacity the golds go up to 80 whereas the ones in the normal countries only go up to 60 but that's the selection that I've got in Canada I built up quite a decent pile of trains there but basically all I'm waiting for is to cash in a couple of the jobs here and I'll move up the level into Russia so I'll do that now and that will put me up to level 300 which is new region which is now unlocked on there as well so that now means any trains that I earn uh, will go into that new country first thing I want to do now that I've got my Russian trains available I still need to actually open up crates to get them they're all the ones which I haven't don't own yet but the first thing I want to do is cash in my event legendary and get that upgraded so I can go and collect some gold so I'll do that and I'll come back to you in a moment to open the crates so here we are I've collected my event gold legendary and upgraded it so i could go and get a first lot of gold so now we're ready to start seeing what i get of these ones here so go down and we'll start chomping away at 50 of the 100 key crates 
um, I'm not going to keep a tally for the moment of what ones I get. Um, if anybody wants to get the stats, then you're welcome to watch this and know that down yourself. I'll just be worried about what I've got right at the end. But we'll get started. Because this may end up being long enough as it is. Opening 100 crates. I can see that was a common one. There's going to be a lot of common trains. That's better. I'm not going to linger too long on each one you see quick enough what it is as it shows it there and as it comes up i don't want this video to be 17 hours long i'm not doing too bad on epic so far i was expecting a lot more commons but as i say i want a reasonable amount of duplicates anyway. I mean certainly if you're not at Russia yet and you would like a little view because you can spin the trains around of the Russian trains when I'm done just let me know in the comments and I can do a short video on that as well. This is what I'm expecting lots of duplicate commons. I don't mind more epics than what I need because I could do with the epic parts. But I mean, for example, on the duplicates that I keep, um, like on the Purple Epics, there's three different electric trains. I want four electric ones, and I'd prefer to keep one of each different train. So if I end up getting a couple of duplicates of one of them, then obviously I'll dismantle all but one duplicate. If I then get an Epic Electric from an event, I'll delete my other duplicate. Um, I'll only try and upgrade one of each colour and each fuel type at a time. So the one I dismantle wouldn't have been upgraded at all, so I'm not wasting parts. But then if I were to get another event, um, Epic Electric, I'll still keep the three normal ones I've got because they're all different trains. But it's just really annoying that Russia has got, on all four types of train, all three different fuel types. When we're currently on an event at the moment, which is given a lot of double restrictions. So my event scores are going to be going downhill. But also, as a note, um, at the moment of the three jobs I've got on the event... Uh, one was a Region 4, and two jobs were Region 5, Canada. When I've upgraded to Russia, like I've just done, that will make it one job on Region 5, two on Region 6. But because I collected both of those jobs straight away, that hasn't reset yet. So I've still got those two jobs on Region 5, where I've got decent trains. So that's going to help with the next couple of hours of gameplay. But 
I don't believe it's given me a legendary gold one yet. But I had more than enough gold parts to upgrade that event legendary. But it's the actual gold coins, it did take a lot of them. I think it was well over a hundred thousand. See, it just goes past the legendary. Um, it does tell you the odds on these crates. It's a 2% chance of a legendary, 8% on an epic, 15% of a rare, and 75% on a common. Those percentages do get better on the 200 key crates, which is why I'm going to try some of them. But opinion is divided in the various Facebook groups on whether it's best to do just the 100 or just the 200. So I'm going to mix in a couple of the 200 ones in case that does give me a better chance of some more of the legendaries. But it's always nice to see a not owned yet one come up. We'll just have a quick check, see how many I've done. So another 10, and then we'll try 200 crates. just thought if there is any algorithms to what trains this gives you that's why I'd mix it up and do 50 odd 100 key crates first and then do 200 key crates and then come back with a few more hundreds and obviously the more trains I unlock the less chance there is of getting one which I haven't unlocked yet. And another new one. So I've also got the keys that I've won in the event reward ribbon to claim as well. And also um, several train crates in there as well. I've gone for the event pass. But I haven't grabbed that train yet. I want to get these out of the way first. I'm guessing... That's round about another 10. I 
Ah, that was 12, right. Let's go for 25 of 8. Oh, tell you what. Let's have a quick look. See what the mix is I've got there. So, yeah, haven't won a single legendary one yet. But it's only the four legendary, and one of them you can only get from doing the story jobs anyway. And two of the rares. Let's see, 11 of that one there. A few duplicates on the rare, but quite a few duplicates on the epic, which is good. So let's see if I can count down 25 of these and see if this gives a better mix at all. The percentage chance here is 5% legendary, 15% epic, 40% rare and 40% common. So I should find at least myself getting a lot more blue ones this time. But again, epics is good. Epic parts are the bits that I'm shortest on. So if I've got a lot of duplicates enough that I can dismantle some, that's going to give me parts to upgrade the ones I need to. Plus normally in the rewards ribbon as well. Uh, these are random crates. You can get crates which will pretty much give you an epic or give you a um, legendary. So I'll get those in the event. So that's um, it should be guaranteed at least one legendary train from the last prize in the event ribbon. certainly in the Facebook groups the main consensus seems to be for twice the amount of keys the 200 compared to the 100 crates the percentage um, rarity drop isn't that beneficial for getting the 200 crates And finally, a legendary. I think that was crate number 15. I was at 50 on the 100 crate key crates, and I didn't get a single legendary. And another new one, good. Oh. Right. 
crate. I think this will be the last 200 crate. We'll go back to the hundreds. I mean, obviously, continuing to play the game, I'll keep on earning keys. So I can keep opening more crates as I go through a region, but like I've saved up, there's a certain stage when I don't feel as though I need any more, I'll start saving up keys ready for the next region. It's annoying when it gets that close. Once I've got through these last few 100 key crates, I'll go and I'll get the keys off the reward ribbon um, and as I go through the trains and the crates and the reward ribbon as well I'll show you what I get there. Oh. Right, so that's the end of my key supply. So let's see where we're looking at here. So, yeah, one more legendary that I've now got five, nine, ten. 14 epics twenty three rares and quite a lot of commons about fifty commons so first thing I'll quickly do is that's the event pass train so at least I've got a decent size carrying blue electric and I'll go along some of this and by the time I get to the crates I'll bring you back in to see what I get from the crates so here we are these two crates this one is pretty much guaranteed to be a common there we go. and this one should pretty much be a rare That one, nothing new. I'll be back again in a mo. And the next pair of reward ribbon crates. Another blue. 
a mixture be an epic? And that's the last two of here for the night. See, I've made it a fair way along the event ribbon, so there's not much left to go. Just those two crates at the end now. Right, I'll come back to those in a little while, but we use up these last five lots of hundred crates. So that's my opening fleet for Russia. All I need to go do now is go through and figure out which ones I don't want duplicates of and cash them in and that will help take my parts up for upgrading other trains. For example, an excess one of them will give me 186 purple parts. So I'll go and sort through all that and I hope you've liked this video. Um, if there's anything else you'd like me to cover, then let me know in the comments below. Uh, and certainly if you've liked this and you'd like to see more, uh, a subscribe always helps as well. But I think that's it for today. I'd better get back on playing the event and hope to see you in the game. Thank you.